And now it is time to go to the Luncheon Kingdom, I believe. Oh no, it's the sea Seaside Kingdom. Right, right. Oh, champagne, anyone? Seaside Kingdom. I'm gonna wear that those good old shorts. <laughs> the glass is half empty. Yeah, because that freaking Mozart dude is drinking up all the freaking water. What's on top of that fancy goblet? It is a Mario Sh Sunshine enemy. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Oh, this is a funny, like, topic to talk about. Mario has them good old titties, right? But when you play, like, Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom, Link doesn't have titties. Don't know why. Oh, I didn't even show uh, another thing in this game, which is kind of funny. I don't know if there's any dogs in this kingdom. But uh, if I can find another dog, then I'll show you guys. But um, the dogs in this game have booty holes. So let me just go down this pipe. <laughs> And get back into the Odyssey. It's funny that we spawn at top, but yeah. So yeah, the, the Odyssey has... Is it three different ways to enter? You can enter from the back, the front. You can actually ground pound the top and go down as well. Like the little uh, manholes in uh, Mario Sunshine. Let us go this way. I don't need many moons in this place either. I think the kingdom with the most moons you have to get is maybe New Donk City. Uh, oh, these mini games are cool. Wherever your controller is vibrating the most is where the moon is. Is it here? Yeah, there we go. Oh, the moons are purple here. Heck yeah. Thank you, snail guy. Yeah, that's the locals here. Oh my god. I forgot about this part. I don't know if I'd be able to do it. I could probably just get my Joy Cons and do it. But this mini game here, good old volleyball. So can I play it right now? Oh, it's a later thing. Okay. Flag. Beach house. Ooh, it's a nice beach house. This is a nice beach house. Oh yeah, I can get a nut and plant some moons right there. <laughs> What's up there, Dory? I think that's Dory, unless this is a different one. Oh yeah, the currency is shells here. So basically, Lake Kingdom is Mario 64, and Seaside Kingdom is uh, Mario Sunshine. <laughs> and they both have cheap cheeps. Can I go this way, or is that the end of the world? Yeah, that's the end of the world. Okay. Dang. It ain't open world. Oh yeah, if you shake the Pro Controller, you can attack. I forgot about that. Down the water. Look at all those crabs. This also makes me think of that uh, crab game that came out recently, where it's like Dark Souls, but it's like you play as a crab, I think, or a lobster, I don't know, and you're like underwater and stuff. Oh, I can go down there and get a moon, I think. Uh, I guess you could get coins right there. But yeah, I love the Seaside Kingdom and the like the water, the ocean part or whatever, is pretty darn big and has a lot to do under here a lot of good stuff to do under here for sure um but i forget what i need to be doing exactly oh god there's a lot of seaweeds coming after me uh oh there's a sphinx here and there's a lot of fish oh can you not get down here normally with mario i guess this will like bring you up like in mario 64 I think in every world it's 15 coins to get like the first outfit. So yeah. Nice. And I have all the coins to get the outfit. Oh no, I was I was in the water but now I got all sandy again. Oh yeah, Bowser was here. Another checkpoint. I think that's where you get a health increase. Oh yeah, watch this guys. Watch this. I can be Jesus. Woohoo! <laughs> nice. Oh, there's a freaking moon under you. Give me that moon. Give me that moon. There we go. It's purple, just like Dory. Right, let me get an outfit. All right, we got the the Yuffie outfit. That's what it is here. Oh my God, we got pirate Goombas, <laughs> and we got freaking shell balls coming after us. But we can easily dodge them. Oh, <gasps> I dodged it. <laughs> I think there's a yeah, there's a lady Goomba there. So if you get a stack of male Goombas. She'll be like, ooh, I like your size. Oh, man, Mario, you're epic. Break them good old boxes. 
another checkpoint and a power moon. Yeah, so that's basically what I was supposed to be doing this entire time. <laughs> Is get a power moon and ground pound a switch. And they are locked behind the power moon, so yeah. Oh, look at that lava over there. And there's the next uh, switch that I gotta get. And there's another one right there and another one right there. There's four switches. Boom! So by doing that, you release a cork and then... Bah! <laughs> Painful, dude. Freaking knocked his pirate hat off, too. Oh. He's got lava hair. Oh, he's just shooting... Uh, are those urchins? He's shooting a lot of those. Woohoo! Alright, so I think these things are called gushins. But these things make me think of uh, Mario Sunshine. But as you can see, you can go forward. And you can go upward. So it's like, um, oh, what's her name? Is it, it's not Flush, is it? Flood, that's it, not Flush. <laughs> flood, that's her name. But we are Flood. Okay, so shaking it does that. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, yeah, and you will run out of water too, so. All right, so there is lava here. And we got our trusty gushing right here so we can get rid of all this lava, but we gotta be careful because we don't want to, you know, fall into it. And if you shake the controller, you can just like get it all out like that. Yeah. Wait, did the checkpoint give me more water? Hmm. It'd be funny if it did. Aha, there it is. The next power moon. Woohoo, thank you for your contribution. Nice. Alright. Second switch has been uncovered and now it's time to ground pound pound it boom take that excellent work uh let's do that one up there that one's actually probably the easiest because you literally just need a gushing and you just shoot your way up there that's literally all it is oh no that one's actually the easiest because you just well actually i don't know i think that one might be the easiest because that has, like, the balls and stuff over there. Oh, my God. That almost hit me. Woohoo! Give me your gushing abilities. Woohoo! There we go. Oh, I got hit. Dang it. Is it literally just right here? Oh, you got to be careful not to use all your water. It's literally just right here. Dang. Oh, that gushing just died. <laughs> it just disappeared. Heck, yeah. Ooh, nice health. Third switch. Has been pressed. Woo. Bonk. Man, this must be very annoying for him. He's probably got a huge headache now. Alright, so I think I actually need a cheap cheap for this one. Oh yeah, these things. So, you would think that this is just like an environmental thing, but I think these are like living creatures. I think. And if so, that's really weird. Alright, so I need a cheap cheap because I don't think I can just go up there. I think I have to like go around. Peach, because there's like no steps up there. And I don't think a gushing can like get all the way up there. I don't know. I think this is the correct way of doing it. Ah. Ah. Okay, there we go. Huh. Come here, cheap cheap. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy, let's go. Okay, now I gotta go up here. I can't breathe. I like how heavy the fish feels. Or, sorry, the cheap cheap. When it's like not in water. Down the pipe we go. Well, that's not really a pipe, but yeah. Oh my god. Why'd you get rid of my cheap cheap if you're just gonna immediately give me one? Oh, ready for Mario 64? These are straight up the eels from Mario 64. Okay, nice. Oh, dang it. I always get hit at least once whenever I do this. Alright. Yep, a couple more. Or a few. Oh, quadruple more. Surface. Hey, there's a pipe. All right, we have made it to the top. And it's the last one, too. Heck yeah. Now we can rid this boss of his existence. And now we can ground pound the last switch. Cutscene for the last one. Boom, son. Yes, sir.
<laughs> He's angry. All right, I need a gusher. I mean a gusher, not a gusher. <laughs> or are they called gushers? I thought they were called like gushers. You see him diving, dude? He's like, Whoa, oh my god. Don't you be laughing. Don't be laughing if you know you're going to lose, buddy. You got to be quick with it. Ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba 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 I don't know if spinning is better. I think this is better for him because it's like his head. So you're like shooting below him by doing that. Oh, was he not down? I thought he was down. I thought I got him. Ah. Oh, God. He probably has a gigantic headache right now. There we go. I don't know. He's going crazy. He's spinning out of control. Oh, my God. Okay, so I think the lava's just, like, gone now, right? And now you literally just have to hit his head. Man, that water must be very strong if it hurts his head without, like, lava on his head. He got a big bulbous head. Oh, nice. Number two. Oh, it's like they go gray whenever they run out of water, but then they turn purple when they do have water. Oh, that was close. Yeah, I love this boss fight. It's really great. Action packs and pretty quick, you know. Oh, is this a four cycle? The music is epic too. Hello, Gusher. How are you doing? We're gushing. God, keep calling it a Gusher, but I don't know if it actually is called a Gusher though. Oh, he's got freaking torpedoes. Torpedo? No, I don't know if that's what it is. I think it's actually tornado, right? Harpoon. Good old um, Legend of Dragoon. Never played that game. I have it on my PS5, but uh. That is Grind Central. Oh, I thought you got dealt damage when you hit his head. I want them to remake that game. Ah, uh, Wait, I want... Did I say I want you to remake that game? I want them, the creators of the game, to remake it for, like, PS5. And it fix a lot of the grinding issues. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This guy is so annoying. Just let me get you, buddy. There we go. Yes! And he's down. <laughs> Get off the side of Mario. Oh, God, it's huge. Boom! He's dead. See you later, buddy. And we fall into the water. Yay. And now it's being filled again. I think he can actually go down to the bottom. I don't remember what's down there. Is it like a painting or is it like a moon? Oh, it's a painting for whatever kingdom. There's also a water bubble. Multi-moon! All right, let me get my controller so I can show you guys this epic minigame strat. Heck yeah, we did it! Oh my goodness, what a pretty sunset. Yeah, this place looks awesome. Oh, it's sparkle water. Okay. Yeah, dude, look at this. This is like so freaking beautiful. I think I like this. Uh, I like the sunset more than the previous one. Oh my god, it's the dog! Yeah, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Doggy got a booty hole. <laughs> He's like, don't show my booty hole. <laughs> nice. I freaking love this outfit. So, this is a cheeky little minigame strat. Alright, so, two players. And I'm going to go to two-player mode. So, that's Mario and this is Cappy. Yes, sir. Alright, so I'm probably going to fail immediately, but there we go. Oh, wait. Oh, do you have to hold it on this controller? Okay, but yeah. So Mario can just chill in the corner. And, you know, player one, player two, or, or whatever, can control Cappy to hit the volleyball. Because Cappy is not floaty, and he's very quick. He's very quick with it. So, like, this minigame is a lot easier to do as Cappy. It does get faster, but, like, yeah. And also, you want to be aware of Mario not to, like, hit him. Because I think if you hit him... Mario will start wearing Cappy again. Alright, I don't know how many of these I need, but like, yeah. Oh, Cappy kind of bounces when he hits it too. But not too much of a bounce. That's not too bad. But yeah, this is like way better to do. Okay, well yeah, if you hit Mario, then you could just like press Y as Mario. Oh, there we go. Nice. First uh, power move for doing that. I think you can actually get like two or three. Maybe it's just two. Oh yeah, Cappy also kind of like floats in uh, player two as well. But yeah, there we go. Nice little minigame strat. 
much easier than, you know, doing this. Because, like, watch this craziness right here, man. You don't have to do that every time. And you see how, like, kind of floaty Mario's movements, in, movements is and stuff? So, yeah, it's, it's just easier to do it as, you know, Cappy and stuff. Alright, back to one player. I think I could just let my Joy-Con controller just chill on the desk. But, yeah. Alright, Seaside Kingdom is complete. Now I think it is time for Luncheon Kingdom. Dang, son, where'd you find this? I found it in the Seaside Kingdom. 